what's up gang i hope everybody is doing well i miss y'all so so much um shout out to my gang my uh magical flowers tarot gang shout out to y'all i always got to give it up to y'all first and foremost because y'all are so genuine and authentic with me y'all love on me y'all regulating my comments so i gotta <laughs> always give it to y'all thank y'all for also migrating to other platforms to you know just to Stay in tune with my Mama Magical. Um, thank you for coming over to Twitter for my podcast and my Instagram. You can also find me at these places, all under Magical Flowers Tarot. Um, also to my personal clients, thank you. I love y'all so much. Shout out to the new subscribers. I do do personal readings. Um, you can reach me at my website at www.magicalflowerstarot.com. Um, in regards to my YouTube channel, if you would like to request certain um, readings or just want to shoot me some information, you can definitely write me at magicalflowerstarot at yahoo.com. So let's get into this, y'all. Bernie Mac, we're going to do a real quick reading. I see you guys have some, a couple of questions on Bernie Mac and his situation. We're going to just send, first of all, love and light to that brother. So let's get into this reading. It ain't going to go too deep. Um, I always tell y'all to cover your heads. You know, just, you know, things that I do for myself for protection as well. Because we're tapping into the spirit world, so that's always important. All things I do for myself, I wish for my subscribers and my family. I love y'all. So let's get into this, y'all, really quick. Um, I ain't going to get that deep with him, like I said. I ain't really trying to pull on his spirit like that we just gonna see if anything comes up and what his spirit has to say so y'all already know how i do i'm gonna start off by tapping into his energy bernie mac bernie mac bernie mac mm. okay so y'all want to know y'all want to jump straight into this steve harvey thing so what is the energy around steve harvey what was the energy between bernie mac and steve harvey spirit show us the true energy between bernie mac and steve harvey Show me the energy between the two of them. When Bernie Mac was amongst the living, what was his? What was Steve Harvey's energy towards him? What was the energy towards each other? Mm. Look at that King of Cups, that King of Wands that just flipped. That was interesting to me. Spirit, what is the energy between Bernie Mac and Steve Harvey? What was the energy, Spirit? Show us the truth. What was it like between the two of them? Mm. Straight out the gate. They have some painful times, y'all. Mm, divine timing. Three of wands. Mm. It seemed like there was some type of competition to me between very unhealthy habits between the two of them, too. Almost like obsessive energy that I'm picking up. It was really fiery between the two of them as well. I feel like it was a lot of hotness around them. Um... Also, I definitely feel like coins were being fucked with. You know, people were trying, someone was trying to stop someone's money. Queen of Pentacles, reverse. Somebody was trying to stop like bookings and shows. I feel like that's come to me as well. It was just like, I'm not really celebrating you like you deserve to be celebrated. One of them was feeling that about the other one. And I don't think it was Bernie Mac. But yeah, it's like somebody was definitely trying to block somebody's manifestations, communications with other people, just people actions. Like, I don't know, Three of Wands. I don't know why. I know she's standing in front of water, but I see someone standing on a stage. Um, and I feel like something was bound to happen with this divine timing. Six of Swords reversed. That's me. No, basically, shit. It was really painful between the two of them. It was some... It was a hard, they 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 suffered some hard times in their friendship, relationship, or whatever, whatever it was. But somebody was definitely trying to control the narrative in someone's career. Jealousy, Queen of Wands. I know it. I knew it was finna come out. I knew it because that King of Wands came out. Temperance. Patient. Patiently waiting. Will of Fortune, Temperance, Patiently Waiting, King of Cups. So I feel like the emotions between them was just not stable. They really didn't fuck with each other like that. I feel like this is the damn root cause, though, right here. Nine of Pentacles reversed, exactly. So somebody definitely was trying to stop the bag. Somebody was jealous as hell that was trying to stop the bag. And I feel like this person that was trying to stop the bag was obsessively, dangerously jealous. The devil. So let's see what else come up, y'all. Ooh, that was through the gate. <laughs> that was through the gate. Okay. Mm, so that's why we still on Steve Harvey. Y'all want to know, does Steve Harvey have anything to do with Bernie Mac's death? Mm, interesting. Y'all think that? Let me know down in the comments. 
here. Does Steve Harvey have anything at all to do with Bernie Mac's death? Sacrifice card for new beginnings, page of pentacles, red flags, the world, <clears throat> damned your light, didn't want to see you shine, didn't want to get you to the next level, want to take you that, like they say, the world is the stage, right? Mm, eight of cups. I feel like he tried to send people his way, women in particular his way, but he definitely had a hand in it, I feel. This is what I'm saying. He already knew. Now, let's not, you know, I feel like Bernie Mac did have some health issues. He definitely, definitely did. He was in a very vulnerable state, I feel, even probably at a time where he did not even know. But what's interesting to me is that this Two of Swords, which I call a sacrificial card, y'all, my gang know why I've explained it every video almost when this card comes up, and Page of Pentacles for the new beginning, the entrepreneur, the intern, someone trying to climb the top sacrifice reverse red flags taking action and eight of cups reverse this is sad this is someone to me when i see this is somebody going on to a spiritual journey or crossing over or if you want to go traditional not being able to get over some shit not being able to move on past something highly weird there we go the hierophant six of cup the past mm, will of fortune it was a, it was just it was it was gonna happen. Eight of Pentacles reverse, taking you out of your work, your skill, stopping it. So the next question you guys had, oh I ain't never heard of this one before. This is a regarding Steve Harvey's wife, Marjorie. Did Marjorie ever try to talk to Bernie Mac? I never heard of that before. So let's see what the spirits got to say. Now, all this is alleged, child. Y'all already know that. <laughs> but we know what it really is. Did Marjorie ever try to talk to Bernie Mac at any point? Did she ever try to make any type of romantic, intimate advances towards Bernie Mac? Because y'all got to think, who was more famous at that time between Bernie Mac and Steve Harvey right before he passed? Now, they've both been in the game for a long time, respectively. Steve Harvey had his show. Bernie Mac had his show. Did Marjorie ever try to initiate any advances towards him? Mm, I don't see it, y'all. Nope, that's not true. The of Swords. Mm -mm, she didn't. And if she did, it wasn't nothing because <laughs> it ain't coming up. Queen of Wands. Mm, I don't think she... Now, although Marjorie is an opportunist in her own ways, but I don't feel like that she... Let me pull one more. Holly Weird. Is that he coming up? No, nah, she didn't. At least I don't see it. I don't know. Maybe she made a comment, but whatever it was, it's not... It ain't coming up, so it won shit. Mind you, Bernie Mac was married, you know, and he spoke highly of his wife, although men still do them anyway, but it definitely did not, he didn't do him with her, I'll say that. So the next question is, um, what is Bernie Mac's energy currently towards mm, Steve Harvey, how does his spirit feel towards Steve Harvey, D.L. Hughley, and Cedric the Entertainer? How does Bernie Mac's, how is his current energy feeling? Mm. Ace of Swords. How is his energy feeling towards them? <laughs> He's not satisfied at all. Sneakiness, high priestess. Things that y'all don't know. Secrets, hidden knowledge, occult. Mm. Sacrifice. Wow. Mm, here you go. And he feel like you know. You can't teach it. He said, You can't teach your old dog new tricks. Motherfuckers are still the same. They ain't changed. There it go. This is how he feeling. 
Y'all see what time it is. Hmm. Okay, so the next question y'all wanted to know, is it true, is there any truth that Steve Harvey was stealing Barney Max jokes, stealing his material, his content? Was Steve Harvey stealing jokes from Barney Mac in particular? Oh, wow. Okay. The Emperor. Death. Mm, the study falling out. Mm, he want us to know. <laughs> he want us to know. I definitely feel like Steve Harvey's had some insecurities for sure when it came to him. Ace of Cups, Foundation. This is Jesus. Mm. I feel like he took something. Steve Harvey is a very extreme manipulator. He's very tricky and crafty. He definitely did. The star reverse. He just didn't want Bernie to be the biggest star. That was some jealousy there. And he definitely did. If he wasn't outright blatant with it, he definitely um, manipulated some shit. So he could definitely, I feel, bite off of his material a little bit. Eight of Wands also can speak about a message coming through or material to me. Ten of Pentacles. It's been ha it, was, it was happening for a while, too. This is years with this situation between the two of them. Everything is fine reverse. There it go. So, yeah. And it caused problems between the two of them, too. See, it's a lot of things that Bernie didn't want to prove, didn't prove um, when it came to it, but he knew, you know. But he wasn't too vocal about it, but he knew. And I feel like it was the time that he, he actually confronted Steve about this. Mm, so, let's jump over to these sex parties, Roma Shaw. Y'all think Stevie was taking... Try to get Bernie to go to them sex parties. Nah, I never heard of that neither. But y'all are saying that Bernie declined. So, still, is there any truth to the sex party rumors between Steve Harvey, Steve Harvey and Bernie Mac? Did Steve ever try to get Bernie Mac to attend any type of sex party? Orgies, anything of that nature. Hmm. There we go again. Mm. Wow. <laughs> Bernie is coming through with this. He wants y'all to know who had a hand and what happened to him. Death, the sun, red flags, a naked lady, the star. We already know that Bernie is reversed. Sacrifice in the occult. Yes, he did. Look at this naked lady. I want y'all to pay attention to images. Strength again. Reverse. Page of Swords. People were spying and watching on him. Watching Bernie, too. Guards was down. Judgment. Yes, he did. He called him up. He planned for things to happen. Bernie, I feel like this is speaking on his marriage, too, and his morals. Ace of Swords reversed. So, yeah, he did. I feel like he would try to use women. The fool. Ooh, look at this. Yeah. Very, very reckless behavior that can cause harm to someone. The world. Trying to keep you down. Trying to put you in positions also to make a fool of yourself. Because you know the media will chew you up and spit you out. Catch you in a vulnerable position. The strength reverse. Catch you doing something on camera that can leak out to the world and got you looking bad. All types of little conniving, you know, set up type of situations. Okay, so y'all want to know, did um, did he know? See, I told y'all, this is going to be a short reading. Did he know about the cloning facilities? Did Bernie Mac know anything about cloning facilities? Y'all know this ain't conspiracy theories. This ain't paranoia talk. I mean, because at this day and age, it's very known that they clone. They show us on the news if you pay attention. So, did Bernie Mac know anything about cloning facilities? It caused him problems, five of swords. Ten of Cups took him away from his family. 
his daughter tried to put him in poverty too. Mm, I feel like he did know, especially I don't know why. When I see these people in twos, look at this. Pay attention to the images. Twos, 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 cloning, sacrifices, vulnerable, weak positions. Money, sex, drugs, seven of cups, illusion, sneakiness, psychic ability, spiritual energy, the hangman, change of routines. I feel like he did. He definitely did. Pay attention to them images. He knew. The empress. Mm. Cultivating something. Growing something in a lab. And it's a lot of money in that business, too. I've seen it on the Empress card. I hope y'all paid attention. So, before we wrap this up, does his family feel suspicious about his death at all? Does his family feel suspicious about his death? Do they feel like it's more to the story? Does the family feel sus suspicious about Bernie Mac's past? His wife does for sure. Hollywood, there it go. Come through the world. They Hollywood stopped him, took him up out of this world, watched him, took him up out of his work. Reckless, foolish situations people were trying to put him in. Very harmful situations people were trying to put him in. People were trying to trick him out of his marriage, quote unquote. You know, someone trying to put him, I ain't gonna quote that, I'm sorry, but somebody was basically trying to separate him from his family, his wife. It was highly weird. It was putting him in all sorts of crazy situations, offering him shit and drinks, parties, not the cups when I see this. King of Swords. We already know King of Swords has no love. And it was on divine timing when it was this was bound to happen to him. He was paranoid too. Secrets. Magic. Three of Pentacles. People were working against him. There was communication behind his back to try to harm him. That's what she feels. And to end him, Ten of Swords can represent murder as well. Mm. Page of Cups. That's his daughter, too. Take him. Mm. They try to fuck with his money, too. Six of Pentacles. I knew it. Reverse. Try to fuck with his money. They don't give to his family like they deserve to be got. The Emperor. Somebody definitely also, she feels, orchestrated and controls this whole situation. Even the narrative. Two of Pentacles. Ace of Swords, right. She don't believe it. She don't believe what they tried to say his cause of death was. She doesn't believe any of that. She don't trust Hollywood. She don't fuck with Hollywood. Particularly, I'm talking about his fam, his wife. Exactly. She know how they play in Hollywood. Holly weird. She know what time it is. Ooh, child. Okay, y'all. I just wanted to do like a little quick reading. I didn't want to go too, too deep into that type of energy. Um, but y'all see what it is. Let me know down in the comments. Because some of this stuff, y'all want to read on Steve Harvey <laughs> and Miss Marjorie. Let me know. But definitely tell me how you fit in the comments. I didn't know some of these things. Like the advance, the supposed rumor about the sex parties. Now that I'm saying that out loud, though, I feel like I do remember something similarly being told about that so definitely let me know you guys let me know if you guys have any question i mean any more requests for readings i will be doing my podcast later on today so be on the lookout for that i'll link that below and yeah y'all let's talk about it okay family i love y'all so much gang peace love blessings abundance all that for my gang all the things that i pray for y'all i pray for myself ashe <laughs>